So who would Hermitage play in the 5A South? Regional final game, Elsie Bird or top seeded Highland Springs? Top seed Highland Springs in a fight. You knew it would be one against defending, two-time defending champion L.C. Bird. Early on, give the big man the rock, feed him. Steven Mines on the ground, and you knew that after watching the Meadowbrook tape and knowing that L.C. Bird can run the ball well, that they would go right at Highland Springs. They do, and that touchdown, they deferred the opening kickoff. They actually started that drive with an onside kick and recovered. Mines finishes it. Later, is there a fumble? Refs say no, the run is good for Greg Dortch on the end around, and they cap it off with a touchdown, DJ Anderson. And we're all knotted up, seven apiece. Back comes Mines, though. He was a load to take down Steven Mines. And they got a bevy of backs at LC Bird, which would prove paramount for the Skyhawks. And the Skyhawks hardly went to the air, but this was one of them. Back to Mines. They all go one direction, and then they throw the screen to the other side where they got a receiver as a blocker. Beautifully drawn up play. It's worked all season for Bird. Works again here. Touchdown. Skyhawks, they'd have a 14-7 lead. Still in the first quarter. Second quarter, though, you think the Springers are going away? Heck no. Pass complete. Felton Davis with the completion and the first down. That would lead to this. The field goal attempt. Bird would get a stop. Highland Springs can kick the ball these days. Field goal up and good, 14-10, still 7.30 to go in the second quarter. Now, Mines back on the ground again, but he runs into a landmine defensive end. And the Springer defense comes up with a big time recovery, and that would lead to this late second quarter. Look how much time Jawan Carter has. More time? Well, not quite as much time as Tony Romo did against my New York Giants the other night in the game winning drive, but a lot of time. He finds Greg. Dorch for a big time catch inside the 20. And Dorch, I mean, he's not a tall guy, but he catches everything, including this. The touchdown grab down the middle. Little seam route, touchdown, Highland Springs. Springer's back on top. Seesaw a fair seat. Look at him next to Felton Davis. 16-14 would be the lead. But before the half, Skyhawks with a chance to retake the lead. Quarterback going to call his own number, Jalen Elliott. With a long run into Springer territory. They would be forced back with penalties though and on third and goal. Intercepted. Highland Springs. Devon Hill with the Oski in the end zone. And the Springers go to the half up to 16-14 second half though. Highland Springs gets the ball first. And the quarterback who threw the pick is a cornerback who intercepts it back. For the free safety, Jalen Elliott with the Oski. And L.C. Bird back in business, and they made their turnovers pay. And this is not Miller time. This is now Jabaru Wright, who came in for Miller in the second half, and he ran like a bulldozer. 22-16, L.C. Bird back on top. Let's go to the fourth quarter, though. Highland Springs, when they need a play, go to the big man. Felton Davis deep inside the five-yard line. He would step out of bounds. It would lead to this, so Jawan Carter had some big passes in this game. None bigger than maybe this one right here. He hits number 15, Kavon Wallace. And the Springers in the fourth quarter, they got the lead back, 23-22. Still a lot of time to go. Springers would get it back to after a defensive stand late in their own end of the field. Can't be hauled in, the catch that is. It's intercepted by number two, Deshaun Dorsey. That would set it up for this. Twice on this drive, L.C. Bird would convert on fourth down. This one on fourth and three. Elliott going to scramble for the first down. That would set it up for this. Number 22 trying to get the lead. Malik Hamilton just over a minute to play. The field goal is absolutely perfect. L.C. Bird up 25 to 23. But Highland Springs had one more chance. Three timeouts, a minute to play. Pass complete. That's good for a first down. Another pass. Get out of bounds, Felton Davis. They were giving him the cushion. They had a chance. They got inside around the 35, but then this happened. Juwan Carter's pass is tipped, and oh no, it's intercepted. Juwan Dorsey again with the big time pick, and Bird ends Highland Springs season 25-23 is your final.